Yo, what's going on guys? Mush back at it with another video. Want to give you guys a heads up on the free PC games you can get with Prime right now. If you have an Amazon Prime subscription, always a good idea to take advantage of the free offerings. And there's some notable stuff that is still free uh, for a little bit. So we'll talk all of that. And I want to highlight some really solid PC game deals that are available directly at Steam. So... We'll talk that in a little bit, but first of all, if you do have a Prime Gaming subscription, you can get a copy of Icewind Dale Enhanced Edition, that is through the Amazon Proprietary Launcher, and then if you want, you can also get a copy of The Beast Inside over on GOG, so two new titles added to Prime Gaming, go check them out, um, whether or not you want to consider them free, nobody actually signs up for Prime to... Uh, uh, go to Prime Gaming, at least I don't think so, that would be very, uh, strange to me, but nevertheless, there is some value with Prime Gaming, and, uh, you know, take advantage of that for sure. Uh, do bear in mind that Wolfenstein The New Order is still available through Prime Gaming, so definitely go add that to your library, that's a high-quality game to add to your library with Prime, and there's a bunch of throwback titles, Metal Slugs in there, Last Blades in there, so some stuff to check out. Also, do remember there's in-game content in a variety of different games, like Lost Ark content, for those of you that are into that, Genshin Impact content. So yeah, you can check all that out. Le uh, League of Legends, the Prime Gaming Capsules are available, Destiny 2, the Spring Showers Exotic Bundle, all of that content is available right now. Moving on from that, I do want to highlight a couple of solid uh, Steam game deals. These are deals directly available on Steam. First of all, we have a couple of CDPR titles. You guys know where I'm going with this. Cyberpunk 2077 is 50% off for $29.99. This is kind of the price point you're going to pay for Cyberpunk 2077. You're not going to find it really any cheaper than this. They did just have that ray tracing overdrive update, but, you know, PCs are getting crushed trying to run that. Nevertheless... The game itself is a lot better than it was at launch, and at this point, you know, we are years and years removed since this game initially came out, and going into it, you're probably not expecting a game, you know, at the level of what the expectations were back in December of 2020. At this point, if you're buying the game at 30 bucks, you're probably just wanting a decent RPG to get into, and it's a pretty darn good RPG with a great setting, great visuals, uh, soundtrack is good. Good bit of content as well. Could it be better? Absolutely. But you look at the uh, change in reception for the game. Uh, now it's sitting at a mostly positive reception on Steam with 530,000 reviews. 79% of those reviews are positive, so much better reception. And at 30 bucks, definitely beats out spending 60 for sure. Obviously, the game will be getting a sizable expansion later this year with the uh, Phantom Liberty expansion. At some point, I'm sure they're going to release a complete edition, but... You know, do you want to wait that long? That's up to you to really decide. Okay, moving on from that, the more better received CDPR title and one of my favorite games of all time, The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt Complete Edition is 70% off for $15, one of the greatest games of all time. But uh, you do have to bear in mind that this is a game that saw its price get jacked up, in fact, because of the next generation upgrade that they rolled out and the update that added some new content. Uh, this used to go on sale for 75% off for $9.99. Now, when it does go on sale, uh, it's $15. On consoles, it's even worse. It's like $30 or $25 for the complete edition. So, kind of a bummer there, but when a game is as good as The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt is, if you have to spend a couple more dollars to get it, you spend the extra couple dollars to get it. It's a tremendous game, and I would still strongly recommend it if you don't have it. And obviously, with the complete edition, you get Blood and Wine, you get Hearts of Stone. That expands the experience quite a bit. Definitely a no-brainer of a pickup there if you're one of the few people that don't own it yet. And lastly, do want to know Crash Bandicoot 4, it's about time, 50% off at $19.99. Why this was a act of a blizz a battle.net exclusive, excuse me, for a while, you know, that. I, I will never understand, but now it's finally available on Steam. The initial $40 price tag was a little bit too high, but at $20, you are getting a great platformer here. And I would say uh, this is the perfect price point to pick the game up for. But that is going to do it for me. Again, Prime Gaming, some quality free stuff. Icewind Dale, Enhanced Edition, The Beast Inside. You can pick both of those up if you are a Prime subscriber alongside Wolfenstein, the new order that has been available for a little bit. Wolfenstein will be available for the next 19 days. Icewind Dale, Beast Inside, the next 30 or so days, so... Jump on those as soon as possible. Cyberpunk 2077, 50% off at $29.99. Good deal on that if you have yet to pick it up. You know, at this point, it's a pretty good RPG. And if you're going into it with tempered expectations, I think you'll be pleasantly surprised. And Witcher 3 Wild Hunt Complete Edition, 70% off at $15. That's going to do it for me. Let me know all your thoughts in the comment section down below. As always, thanks for watching, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.
Hey, what's going on guys? Mush here again. Hope you enjoyed the video. As you guys might know, YouTube's notification system is sometimes a little bit wonky, even if you're subscribed to the channel. Maybe you're not abundantly aware that I uploaded a video to remedy that situation. Make sure you hit the bell notification button. This way, whenever I upload a new video and I try to upload as consistently as possible, you will be notified directly of the upload and you can watch it as soon as it goes live. I would really appreciate if you guys hit that button so you can stay up to date with all of the content I'm posting. But as always, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.